Hi everyone, I'm Kathy Montroy, Deputy Minister of Education and Early Childhood Development. Well, we are almost at the end of this school year, and I want to say a big thank you. I know how hard you've worked this year, and I appreciate everything you've done for your students, their families, and your staff. We started the year with a common goal, and that was keeping our schools safe, so students could continue to learn in their classrooms with their friends, their teachers and staff. And we did that for the most of the year. To reach this goal, a lot was asked of you. We asked you to get your schools ready in September to implement and oversee the public health measures needed to keep schools safe. We asked you to work with staff on a week of professional development in January and then move to at-home learning in April. If there was a COVID case in your schools, we asked you to work with public health on close contacts and keep your students, your staff, and their families calm and focused. Many families started the school year feeling scared and anxious. Those feelings were helped by your confident leadership and ongoing communication home to families. I know I enjoyed the pictures on social media of students learning outdoors and the images of happy children engaged in creative activities. And when we saw some impacts on early literacy, we asked you to focus there. I appreciate the tweets celebrating when student gaps were closed. Our data tells us that many, many of these kids will be ready to learn in September. You set the tone for the school year and led your teachers and staff through the challenging but ultimately successful school year. Throughout it, you all kept an unwavering eye on how are those children doing. We have a lot to celebrate in Nova Scotia, and this successful education year is one of those accomplishments. And for those of you who planned graduation, and I know more than once, thank you. This year was tough on our graduating students, but your efforts helped to identify challenges as opportunity for building resilience and other skills for their futures. I know I speak for everyone in our school communities when I say how thankful I am to have such a capable group of leaders working in our system. I hope you all enjoy a restful summer with your families and friends. I really mean it when I say I recognize the importance of rest and restoration this particular summer. Thankfully, this summer is looking like one that will provide you with many recreational opportunities. Thank you so much for your hard work and I wish you well.